um, this is my minestrone soup. It's quite a nice, decent sized portion, actually, to be honest, isn't yeah, it? Just what do you reckon my... to it? It's nice. Um, What's... Mama, I'm just waiting for my pasta. Yeah, because you didn't want a dessert, you didn't want a star, did you? Stuff like that. What did Ben go for? What did they for him? Some palmer egg, some palmer thing, with some eggs. Thank you so much. Mercy. So yeah, so we're gonna enjoy enjoy these. So yeah. Um, to what? I probably you know what. I probably won't want, want the dessert. I'll probably be full actually. Uh, what I'm gonna do is with my bread, I can actually dip that in with my soup rather than having the oil and stuff. I'm by Ben's reaction, I think he's enjoying that like, his Parma ham thing. I oh, wants to drink a Fanta. Yeah, but so I've been my minestrone soup. A little bit of vegetable cauliflower in this. Be really proud of Sam. He's just eating this bread as well, aren't you? So. I'm a master style, uh, all the yeah. So what do you um, reckon to your um? Bless him. Is that nice? What do you reckon to? Hmm? What do you reckon to your strange soup? It is nice, isn't it? Really, really is nice. My yeah, yeah. Here, bit of bread. Um. That's nice, isn't it? I don't know what it is. Is it, is it um? No, you know what it is. Is it um? See a better bread, but in a different shape. I think it could be. But anyway, this bread is actually nice. Sammy actually is at his. He's also got he's um a bit of mine as well. So I don't mind you eating that because again, I'm not going to eat all of this lot. So yeah. So it's actually filling up in here now. So but anyway. Top the glass up. Top the glass up. Like that man did for you earlier, um. There we go. There you go. You also get one free soft drink as well, and they also do, do give you tap water, but did one of them as well. So yeah, our main course has just turned up now. This is some pasta. They don't think they're not really very well on camera, but the pastas are absolutely green. Sammy said, "Oh, it's green when it turned up." How is that, Sammy? It is nice, isn't it? So we've got some sort of mushroom and tomato thing on there. Stephen and then some chicken thing, some potato thing. How is that, darling? Really nice. Better than what we had last night. It's a hash brown type thing, is it? So yeah, so and is it is it a hash brown thing? So tell you what though, the portion size was quite big. I expected like a little dollop on the plate. Like James Italian. Yeah, like James Italian did, yeah. So anyway, I'm gonna go with my pasta and then we've got obviously got our main dessert afterwards obviously to see Ben's got exactly the same. Um, it's got the chicken and it's also got like exactly this um, like hash brown thing because of this it was fine with the gluten in it. So yeah, so anyway, what's that? That's nice. What's that inside the chicken by the way? Bacon. What? Bacon. Bacon. Mm, really nice. As you can see, it's absolutely packed in there now, it's got really full. So I'm glad I managed to get the red face. I'm not, I'm glad I managed to get the red face in here when I did. You know, are you? But yeah, well, yeah, I'm going to go and eat this now. And then, then we'll wait for our dessert. I've got to see a bit of my pasta to try. What do you reckon to the pasta? It's basil, basil, pesto. It is, isn't it? Pesto, yeah. Yeah. So, so proud of Sammy though. Look, he ate most of that. Did you like your pasta? Yeah. You know, got round your mouth. Come here, let's get pin. Get that pin. I'm going to put it from around your mouth. That's it. The sun's got your nose. You can put the sun on your nose, Sammy. Yeah. But yeah, that's what gets me. We still use factor, we use, we use factor 50, didn't we? Um, I think because there's no shade. When the sun's out in full bloom, there's no shade. Is there? I think that's the problem. So anyway, yeah. So just waiting for our desserts. What did you order for dessert? Some pineapple thing, didn't you? Yeah. I mean, it's time got some sort of cake yeah, thing. Hey. <laughs> yes, we can. On Friday, mummy, what time you check out our room on Friday? Um, by 10 o'clock, darling. And then here we go, here is our pudding. Doesn't that look really, really nice? What's the matter, Sammy? Hello. You don't want the fruit, you just want the cake. Yeah, Mama, look at that. I never have taken the fruit off. I'll take the fruit off. Put it down, wouldn't it? Put it down then, I'll take the fruit off for you. And what did you do it for? Have some pineapple thing. Yeah. Looks really nice though, doesn't it? It's really nice. What's the matter? What's my for stuff, actually? Really do. How's that? Is that nice? Now I took all the fruit off. Yeah. 
because I've had a bit of kiwi fruit, that tastes really nice. I can't think why actually ordered, but it's some sort of fill thing anyway, which like I said looks really nice. Um, yeah, obviously, I'm not too sure, sure if I can eat the flour or not, but anyway, yes, I just left it just in case. But like I said, they're definitely enjoying their pineapple things anyway. Of the Manhattan restaurant, and what do you have? What do you think to that? It was very nice. It was absolutely delicious. I can see why it's really hard to get a um, reservation in there. Um, I'll tell you what, I feel absolutely full now. Really, really do. Obviously, Sammy with the pudding, he took all the fruit off, bless him. Um, but yeah, I definitely recommend getting the meal plans, though, don't you? Mm -hmm. It's definitely worked out loads, loads cheaper. Um, but yeah, um, obviously um, Ben had a gluten free meal and stuff as well. And I said even Sammy absolutely loved it, which he can be quite fussy sometimes. Oh, look at but they were yes, we just have to put it through the Marvel Hotel now. So we'll see what there actually is in here. See if it is actually worth the hype how much it actually is to spend a few days in here. All these pictures on the wall. I don't know who they all are because obviously I'm not into Marvel and everything like that, but I do think they're really, really nice. Yeah, so um, who's that? I don't know who that is, someone who's actually made it and stuff, but yeah. It's nice actually because even though you're not stopping in the hotels, as such, you can still go around and have a look. What's the matter? The best it's a few in the middle. Yeah, mm. and this is the actual um, shop inside because each ho hotel has got its own shop and in here you fall full of Marvel stuff just gonna have a look inside I know it's all Marvel stuff anyway but I know quite a lot of people like Marvel my our nephew is obsessed with Marvel he absolutely loves it oh well Captain America Iron Man I believe there's a comment down below if they're wrong how much are they and how much are they anyway they are 17 euros this place is not too bad for a cup, actually, is it? Yeah. <coughs> not around here. Like all little, all normal bits and pieces around here. Captain America t-shirts, I believe. Yeah. Yeah. They've even got little things all around here. So I keep saying these lay crisps everywhere. They are definitely walkers, aren't they? Yeah, they are walkers. They are walkers. They taste like them as well. We've had enough a couple of packets the last few days. And grouped from Marvel up here as well. Obviously, you won't see me pick up an Iron Man or a Marvel um, now, it's fine because I said not into them. So, but yeah, they're quite good, aren't these little cups? How much are they? They are 17 euros as well. So, technically, you're better off going around getting one of the bigger ones for exactly the same price. Okay, it's nice artwork there, isn't it? And stuff. So, I might, might give me some ideas actually for Zach. Little Avengers, little. <laughs> they remind me of the buddy things for the wrestling ones you'd love to get. <laughs> and then, where's Sammy gone, by the way? Oh, he's behind us. All these little pop bag pops and stuff. And what else I've got around Hello. here? Hiya! Hello. Hello. Got little Captain America figures. Hello. Iron Man. These are pretty cool, aren't they? These little, little watches and stuff. So, yeah, but there's just more little things and they've even got the suitcases around here but yeah I do believe the more th um, other things is actually in the middle to go and see but yeah nice little thing inside here and oh look at the popcorn <laughs> definitely get some um, popcorn and some candy floss before you go back on Friday yeah these are cool aren't they oh you mean all these things over here yeah, yeah. Like Captain America's hand, 160 or 189 euros. That's 100 euros up there. Yeah, I've actually got some euros changed, haven't I? And it's really similar to ours. I have to be careful actually, I don't actually get it confused. But yeah, these are oh wow. So, who are these then, darling? Do you know who are they? Oh no, is that all it is? <laughs> Yeah. So, all different versions of Iron Man all around here. And also up here. So this is this is just recently. Oh look how posh! All over here as well. 
Mm. Yeah, so this hotel just recently reopened for, because um, it had a refit, didn't it? This one did. Because originally it was called Hotel New York and they've changed it to Art of Marvel as well. So yeah, they're really nice down here, aren't they? Right. Do you like these? They're really nice up there. Now we're returning back to... Now so now back down to Disney Village, you know? That's it, so we've got back around here. Yeah. It is very nice in there. Expensive too. There's that one there. To me, it's not worth the extra because we're not into Marvel. I suppose if you was a Marvel fan, then you would be probably all right if you was. Yeah. Right. Right. You know, my But I can't wait for. Obviously, there's a new Port Bay over there. So no, you'd have to admit, and there's Sequoia Lodge. It's just run behind the back of there as well. But you do have to admit, the hotels aren't that far away from each other anyway so but yeah it's a lovely evening out here <coughs> now the sun's dropped it's nice it did get i have to admit it did get a bit, it did get a bit too hot here right in here early on i'll tell you what that was really nice mm. it was tell well, you we're if you lucky, can we're lucky to eat in there yeah we're lucky we've got a reservation yeah. really really am so um you did book it well in advance though, didn't you? i did book it well in advance yeah, yeah. um but if i turn you back round again <coughs> So yeah, so my tip is if you're coming to Disneyland Paris, um, pre-book your restaurants as soon as you book more or less basically um, because you, you can always guarantee you're going to get any slots. I did try for downtown, didn't I? But some of them are all f um, fully booked and stuff. So um, where are we eating tomorrow? Beaver Creek, aren't we? Is it Beaver Creek? Oh, is it Hunter's Grill? And then also now on Thursday we've got Pick Your Own Kitchen which is in the Eventus Campus type place and I do believe that's also been hard to get hold of so yeah quite lucky I managed to get two driving reservations but yeah, like I said as soon as I um as soon as we booked it they said but they got an email how long did they after I booked it? Was it about a couple of days after we booked it? We got an email about booking our tables, didn't we? Yeah, yeah so those are because obviously we booked through Disney Direct. Yeah, going this way, yeah? And obviously we got dining plans, stuff like that, so we can actually pre book them. I'm not too quite sure if you book off site how it works and stuff like that. But yeah, well, yeah, so I don't know what we're going to do now. We're going to go for another walk back into the parks a while. Um, it's nice and quiet. And cool, it? it is loads cooler now. Like I said, it did get far too hot. Really, really did. And loads of people are on the rise because obviously all the strikes and stuff. I'm glad we didn't go for the dream, not the dream shine brighter. It's big stars on parade at quarter to six as well because they actually cancelled that as well. That is one parade we haven't watched yet, have we? But our dining reservation tomorrow isn't until half past six. So we might be able to guarantee the um, big star on parade tomorrow because that's where the dragon goes and lights the fire and stuff. But yeah, so anyway, yeah, I'm going to take a nice leisurely walk back as well. Right, tomorrow lunchtime, we've definitely got to try a uh, sandwich. Yes? Everyone is, keeps ranting and raving about how good it actually is. So we've definitely got to try it. I know Sam would like it because they do lots of toasters and things. You know what you like with your toasters, aren't you? So I think it's probably a bit like Costa, that sort of situation as well. But look, Sammy. You see, there's a plane up there. What, what airport's nearby? Is it Charles de Gaulle? What's she saying of early on? There's about a five, nearly a five hour wait for um, delay. Look at Ben's looking, bless him. He is fascinated with this lake. Come on, Ben. We didn't come for nearly 300 miles for you to stand and look at a lake. <laughs> bless him. Honey, what's it with kids with autism and water? You know, doesn't matter where we go. If there's some water, Ben has to stand there and look at it. <coughs> and that's a good place to eat as well, that Rainforest Cafe as well. So, we go in this way or we go down this way? Go down this way, yeah? See what they've got down the Rainforest Cafe place down here as well. So yeah, so it's good actually. My feet don't really... No, I stopped now a bit for rest. My feet don't hurt. I have actually put my trainers back on, but my trainers are in the car. And <laughs> basically, I can't go off to get right down the bottom of the car park and pick up my trainers, basically. But Mickey, he loved my shoes earlier on, didn't he? He loved my boots earlier on. Have you got a hungry tummy now? Hungry tummy. Have you got a full tummy now? Is it more tummy hungry anymore? No. 
you know what? I wish we could have. I wish we could have eaten there for the next couple of days, actually. But then again, what I might do is tomorrow, because sometimes if you haven't got dinner reservations, sometimes they say. But if you go to go on the day, sometimes they have. So I might go tomorrow and see if they've got any for downtown Disney um, or downtown dining, wherever it is. So yeah, so we get some Look at all these shops around here a bit later on as well. Yeah, this is the Disney Village. Nice to see the sunset. Right, we're not going to see the fire fireworks tonight. We saw them last night and then we had a late night and it was, like I said, about 20 past 12 before you finally got back um, to the apartment and things like that. So, yeah. And what time are we getting back tonight? We're not going to What time are we getting back tonight? Not too late. We're not having too, we're not having too, we're not having too late of a night like tonight, Sammy. So, so yeah, this big sports bar. So there seems to be loads of people around tonight. It really, really does. I know we've got to see a couple of shows as well. We're going to see, we'll see, see the Lion King show at some point as well. So again, we was going to go today to the Court Pass One show in, but they cancelled that, didn't they? Because of what's happened. So again, hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll go tomorrow or even um, Thursday. Yeah, because I can't believe it's Tuesday. I've already got two full days. Wednesday tomorrow. What? Wednesday. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I can't believe we've, got two, we've only got two full days left. And that's it. We enjoy it while we've got it still, basically. We're just heading into Walt Disney Studios now. Um, we tried earlier on and I don't know if it was too hot for Ben or just too many people around. He just couldn't cope with it this morning, could he? I think it was a mixture of both. Now you can see the park is practically empty. I think it closes at 10 because obviously the fireworks are on at 11 and obviously there's not, it's a lot cooler as well now. So yeah, definitely want to, this is what I definitely want to go and do buzz and also do the car. So, and then we might just, just do those two rides and then probably get, oh yeah, need the car, need the, oh yeah, need the magic cars again, don't we? Let's put these in through then so and scrub these out and then we'll scan them. Every finger across, second time lucky we have better luck in here now. Um, again, I know quite a few of the characters are doing the meet and greets in here tomorrow. Sammy wants to meet Olaf, don't you, sweetheart? Um, we really want to try again with Woody or Jesse with Ben, especially where he was with Tigger earlier on, wasn't he? You absolutely love Tigger. Oh, no, I don't want the Spider Man one, I want the Buzz one for Ben. They do them in Buzz, Ariel, Spider Man. There's four of them anyway. So yeah, so we're not going to be too long because obviously we want to be in bed before 20 past 12, don't we? Like we were, yes, like we were, say, this morning. So just do a couple of rides back in here um, because, like I said, we did promise Ben he could go on. So we're digging. Also, you want to go on, do you want to go on Slinky Dog? Yeah? Go on Slinky Dog. So, and then what's after that then? And then what's after, what do you mean? Well, after we've done that then. And then we'll probably head back then, sweetheart. Look, there's Mickey Mouse. We saw Mickey this morning, didn't we? We saw Mickey this afternoon, didn't we? Oh. Yeah. And then we'll probably head back because it's nearly bedtime. Yeah, we're heading with bed and help me, so yeah. And you've got quite a few autographs in your book, haven't you, as well? This doesn't come out very well, but um, they've got like a little stars that light up on there, aren't they? Or obviously they must be projected onto the ceiling somewhere. I'll be in, I'll oh, be there you go. Hopefully it's come out alright. But you may yes so we just I'll be back in here in the morning. Yeah we'll be back in the studios in the morning because like I said we need to come here to get the time slots for um Jesse, Woody and all the other characters don't we around here the other ones we want to meet as well so yeah um right which way do we go first then darling Buzz is down there, isn't it? So we're going to do Buzz. Let's go and do Buzz. Oh, yeah. And do Slinky Dog. Yeah? Buzz and Slinky Dog. And, and, then, and then, obviously, we had our magic shot done here earlier on as well. We've got quite a few photos on our magic. Um, this little photo place, we've got photo points there or something. So, I don't know, you have to get them from somewhere. And then they um, put Monty Magic, like a magic car, um, car plus thing. So yeah. And then, and then, and then. Ooh, do I want some popcorn? Do I? Do I don't know. No, I can get some popcorn to take home with us on Friday, I think. So here are these Buzz Light guns. So what we'll probably do is do Buzz, and I'll probably come back with it one before we go. Before we go back to the apartment. All right, well, before we go back, yeah. 
Now, then look at the difference now. It's so much better in here now, isn't it? Really, really is. Um, Lion King shows in there somewhere. Definitely all go see Lion King. I definitely got to do that before we get home as well. That thing of them monsters where you scream and see if you can fill a can. The yeah, animal. That's making the magician that is in there. So that's a difficult to go see that tomorrow or something. So tell you what, while it's quiet, let's do, let's do some couple of rides while it's quiet, shall we? We're not going to get to do everything. I oh, know we're not. It's, it's just too big. Tell you what, do Crush's Coaster again. No, I'm not doing that again. Do you like Crush's Coaster? No, 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 it's fine. No. No, no, no. Mum's not doing Crush's Coaster. No. No. I'm the theatre, that's where all the things are in there. Who is it, Ben? Is it Buzz? Yeah. Right, um. And over here. We've got Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head over here and with Hetcher Sketch. Salutations! Andy n'est pas là, il est donc l'heure de jouer. Vos right, um, jouer vous attendent. So go through here. That's it. Should we go on our Slinky Dog? Darling? Go on our Slinky Dog. Yeah? Should we go on our Slinky Dog down here? Somebody's looking up there. Tell you what, that's the thing to do if you want to see how to get on with Frozen Land. That's a bit high. Oh, that's just where that drops. Drops very quickly. So, us. Oh, it does, doesn't it? It does. Really does. Obviously, even RC Racer, that puts me as riding school to shame, doesn't it? It's around here somewhere, I think. Is it round here? It's got to be round here somewhere. Anyway, definitely, we'll definitely go on Slinky Dog while we're here. Might as well. So, I like all these little lights and stuff around here, though, don't you? Yeah, is it not a roller coaster? You know what Slinky Dog's like. Slinky Dog is a bit like. Um, oh, bless him. Ben's getting a blessing with, with all it being Toy Story themed. That's what Ben's laugh. Oh, Slinky Dog broken. Oh, Slinky Dog working. Oh, okay. Is Slinky Dog working? I don't know if it is or it isn't actually. Yeah, it is working. That's cool. Go see. The Slinky, Slinky Dog is a bit like um, Sea Storm. Look, see? Yeah. Look at Ben looking. Yes, darling. That's a dry. It's free, isn't it? So we need to find the disabled entry. It's down here. Also, one is possibly if we can try and find the, um, the car road trip. Somewhere down there, somewhere as well. Oh my, oh. Now that does put me as riding the school to shame, doesn't it? No. No, 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 no. Tell me, you're brave enough to do Crush this Ghost, do you know? Oh, off we go, ready on in then. Hang on two seconds, we need to. Where are we? Are we on Slinky Dog? You like Slinky Dog, don't you, Sita? What's the matter, Sammy? Quarter yeah, quarter to nine and we're still on rise. It's funny because we can do this while we're away because even when we're out at Butley's, we obviously were out till 10, 11 o'clock at night. But yeah, when we're at home, we just don't want to bother, do we, Sita? Ready for Slinky Dog? Yeah, who did the Slinky Dog? There's a cheeky smile. Yeah. Ready if we turn you around so you can see what Slinky Dog's like. Ready, hold on.
I think it is actually, it's got to be down there somewhere. Um, yeah, so anyway, we just asked where Buzz is. Apparently, Buzz is in the other park, so we do that tomorrow. We're just doing, it's got goodbye <coughs> down here. So, I don't know what else is down here. Our goodbye, Toy Story. My name is Rex. I do hope to have fun playing outside with all the toys. Cookie Dog says he might even get his pants pulled down today. Now, that would be exciting. <laughs> it's got Rex down there. Yeah. Come on, sweetheart, down we go. So not out to push your houses down here. Definitely want to try and do the cars. You're done in? Our cars, yeah. And um, Ratatouille's down there as well, so, yeah. If we're going to do, we're going to do the cars one while we're down here? Yeah, hopefully we've got enough charge on the battery. Um, what are we doing after we've done cars? I don't know, we'll see. Probably head back then. You'll probably might head back actually soon. Um, it's nice to know what characters actually in um, Newport Bay tonight. Obviously they do character meet and greets in there till 10 o'clock. Oh wow, I've got the aliens on the wall over here. Do you want to see another photo? So she can have a nice selfie in front of that while it's nice and quiet. Yeah? Well, it's true what people say actually. They say it's really busy in the daytime, but coming to the evening, the whole park just goes completely quiet. To infinity and beyond. So yeah, so just we're about to do the cars road trip. So yeah, um, this is pretty cool actually. This is, isn't it? This road. From what I can gather, um, you go along, yeah. <laughs> and you could get wet basically. So I'm not too quite sure how much this is going to be able to film because I've only got 18 percent left on my battery. I only brought two. I did bring the third battery out. I thought I did, but I forgot. So. Yeah, so I've so now definitely got quite a bit on this stuff here. Just a moment. Throughout your journey, please refrain from eating, drinking, and smoking. For your safety, remain seated with your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the tram at all times. Oh, and don't forget to supervise your little one. <laughs> Ready for this? Mesdames et Messieurs, bonsoir et bienvenue à 15 Road Trip. Pour votre sécurité, merci de rester assis toute la durée du trajet. Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome to 15 Road Trip. For your safety, please remain seated during the tour. Bon voyage, ciao! Ciao! Bonjour tout le monde, je m'appelle Sally et je serai votre guide pour vous faire découvrir la route 66 en compagnie de mon amie Rose Ramirez. Thanks Sally, I'm so excited to check out route 66 with you. I'm ready to meet it, dream it and it. Oh là, Rose, sur la route 66, on prend son temps et on s'abandonne au plaisir de rouler. Oh, right, slow it down, relax. Oui, le plus gros écrou de roue du monde. Salut Sally Hey, salut les trous Admirez le plus gros écrou de roue du monde Ciao 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 Les attractions au bord de la route ont été construites pour divertir les voyageurs. Le garage, fantôme, le ghost garage, I'd be dying to get out. Hey, it's the Copper King and Traffic Maze. I've been there. Wow, tu as réussi à sortir du labyrinthe. It was amazing. Je suis irrésistiblement attirée par la vie de la vie. Don't drive in there unless your bumper's on good and tight. Et pour finir, le canyon de Gas Festro. We're driving into Course Tastrophe Canyon. Oui, une merveille tout ce qu'il y a de moins naturel secoué par des micro-séismes toutes les semaines. What? The canyon has an aftershock every few minutes? Oui, that's... Ah, nous voilà. Bien, nous 
Nous allons marquer un court arrêt dans le canyon. Veuillez rester assis et garder mes mains et les bras à l'intérieur du train. Merci. All right, everyone. We're making a short scheduled stop here in the canyon. Please remain seated and keep your hands and arms inside the tram. Thanks. Wow. This canyon is so beautiful and calm. relaxing a little bit now aren't we um we're going to try and hopefully go ben that's not your bed sweetheart this one's your bed so yeah we're going to hopefully try for a bit of an early night as such um like i said it's about 20 past 10 now is it something like that anyway so no, hope it's not 20 past 10 now it's quarter to 11. is it quarter to 11 no way is it quarter to 11 already so anyway yes yeah, so like i said we're going to hopefully try and get an earlyish night, so to speak, so we can try and do magic hours tomorrow morning, and that way we can try and meet a few more of the characters and things like that, so to speak. So yeah, um, you right, darling? Yeah, yeah, you all right, my darling? Yeah, you all right? What is your favourite thing we've done today? I bet your favourite thing today... What do you reckon, um, Ben's favourite thing you've done today was? 
Stinky dog had a good reaction from me, didn't it? What did you do with his glass? It should be there. Stinky dog and car's road trip, wasn't it? Yeah. That was good. So, anyway, what's your favourite thing we've done today so far? I oh, know. I know we did. It's the worst thing I've done today. Chris is going to Yeah, that's the worst thing you've done, wasn't it? Oh, you want to do that again, would you? You'd never leave that one down, would you? So, anyway, Sammy, sweetheart. What was your favourite thing? Yes, when you get back into bed, sweetheart. Um, what was your favourite thing we done today? Um, going on Dumbo. We don't go on Dumbo. Oh, the carousel. Oh, you like the carousel? I was like, was that your favourite ride? I thought you, really? I thought you might have liked um, what some of the other rides we've done. Things we've done quite like I said, we've done so many rides today anyway, it's unbelievable how many we've actually done, isn't it? And who was your favourite character we met today? Um, Mickey. Mickey, wasn't it? So, yeah, so these are the autographs we've got so far. Hope, fingers crossed, we can get some a couple more interactions and characters and stuff t tomorrow because, like I've mentioned before, it was, a, it was a thing of strike, so we couldn't get any. So, yeah, so that was Goofy who we met in the hotel last night. We tried to tonight but we didn't get back in time did we well saying that though we got back at five past ten in the space for that little court pass but there's nobody there so we didn't bother hanging around so we've got goofy who we done yesterday um we've got tigger who we met today haven't we and eeyore and then obviously our good old mickey he liked your t-shirt didn't he yeah. but he actually fell in love with my shoes which are these ones down here and unfortunately they're, they're hurting my feet now I've got a blister on the top so I might get Stephen to go down to the car tomorrow and bring my trainers up I think so yeah so I'm um, gonna bring today's vlog to a close now um, like I said I'm not too quite sure how much footage we've actually filmed do you at the minute mm -hmm. um, to be honest if you haven't even looked at the footage yet so when we get back it's when Stephen will start editing mm -hmm. like crazy wouldn't you mm -hmm. what's not Ben you got the giggles bless him yeah um but obviously we also we're going to possibly try and do is try and meet mickey again properly because earlier on when we met mickey ben just i think the heat got to him today didn't it mm -hmm. Being honest, yeah. he just put himself to the floor and stuff like that so um we're going to hopefully try and see if we can meet him again which be good. So we have got our photo passing where we've had our, who've been our photo taken with oh we had that magic shot haven't we yeah. eeyore and tigger Tell you what, and Mickey, and tell you what, those interactions we've had today have been absolutely amazing, aren't they? Especially with Eeyore and me, because as you can see, I'm, everybody knows I love Winnie the Pooh. And I have to admit, I did have a couple of tears after I met him, again, because I know it's only like a cast when you were dressed up. But yeah, really, really great interactions. I got the biggest squeeze ever, I think, from Eeyore, because I have my Winnie the Pooh. We the Pooh Eeyore yeah, really notebook yeah. and I got him to sign yeah. that and he saw that and he actually fell in love and he gave him a big massive hug so that so anyway yes yeah, so the cat put the battery in the camera is going to flash now so I'm not too quite sure how it's gonna last but anyway thanks for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and then we'll see you tomorrow for day number three, three. yeah because I'm not too quite sure how the vlogs are going to be whether they're going to be half or not well, depends how much footage we film, doesn't it? So there might be in one part, there might be in two. So I don't know yet. We'll just have to wait and see what the editor wants to do with them. So anyway, yeah, um, like I said, I need to try this up now, ready for tomorrow morning. So see you tomorrow. Bye, everyone.